Hello everyone, my name is AppleGuy, and welcome to What Never Was. This is a free game I found on Steam that's supposed to be sort of a story-based one, not not too lengthy, so, so that's nice. Um, it's got some great reviews, and I'm interested to go ahead and take a peek for you guys, and we can uh, we can see what's going on. So I'm going to be playing on control, I just had to get my controller set up, and we're just going to hop right into the game. I don't know too much about it, in fairness. Hey, Mom, where are you? Wait, what? So you're not coming? But I'm already here. I know, but Mom, don't we owe it to Grandpa to... Yeah, I know, it's just... What? You can't sell the clock? Grandpa's had that for years. Okay, okay, whatever, it's fine. I can just start clearing out my boxes and then... I don't know. We can come back tomorrow and do the rest? Yeah. Bye. I was not expecting this game to have voice acting, so that's, uh, that's a big plus. I feel like the voice actress sounded a little bit like Ash Ketchum in some parts, but uh, I'm really going not to as much in Grandpa. other parts. Alright, let's do this. Here we go. Do I need to turn down the graphics settings, or is it... Eh. Nah. I mean, it's, it's indie game, so I'm not, like, expecting the most of everything, but, you know. It's cool. Alright, so it looks like Square interacts with things. It's a magnifying glass. For magnifying things. Magnifying. X investigates. It's a, magnif it's a magnifying glass. It's a magnifying for glass. For magnifying, magnifying things. things. It's a magnifying okay, glass. Okay, okay, I understand what the magnifying for glass is for. It's for magnifying. magnifying things. I'm getting some Nancy Drew vibes in this, and that's pretty cool. I can turn the lamp on and off. It's a banker's lamp. It's a banker's lamp. Okay, you want to tell me about the lamp some oh, more? Oh, Grandpa's old travel diary. Seems like a few pages are missing. Oh, no. Okay. So, okay, in my test, I was getting a little bit of this weird, like... I should see like, if I can find the missing pages before moving this. The I missing should see pages. If I, can find the, I should see, I should see if okay. I can find missing the missing pages, pages got you. before moving um, this. Like, a little bit of, of weird, uh, floatiness. So, like, I'll, I'll let myself, like, I'm not touching any of the controls right now, and I'm just kind of sliding around like I'm on ice. Last time I walked over here, and that kind of fixed it. It's not really fixing it, not a but, globe. you know. Huh. Grandpa sure had some cool stuff that I've never seen. Oh yeah, for sure. Oh, spin it! Fusang. Pele. Pyre something, can't read the rest of it. Shoe. That's probably for a puzzle. Okay, um, let's look at this clock that apparently he's had for ever. My grandfather's grandfather clock. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a... It's locked. Oh, uh, it's locked. There is no way I can pick this up. <laughs> We're really Grandpa Nancy Drew now. Told me it was one of a kind. Although, he never actually told me why. <sighs> it's going to take forever to sort through all these. Grandpa I, sure did mm, like his books. I didn't mean to cut you off. So this is definitely a puzzle. Yo, you have an N64. That's cool. Let's see what games you have. E. Guitar and Piccolo. That's Banjo-Kazooie. Um... Flightway 32, that's Star Fox 64. Something about Merida, that might be a Zelda game. I gotta turn the other way now. That one says Miner something, that looks like Metal Gear. Was Metal Gear on the Nintendo 64? Alright, so I see this. I'll come back to that. I wanted to check out this, because I think this is one of those pages that we were supposed to pick up, right? This seems to belong to the diary. Alright, so I can pick that up. And I can check my inventory by pressing the share button. Alright, I'm hoping this gives us a little bit of a smoother experience. I turned the resolution scaling from high to uh, medium. I should see if I can uh, find Pele, goddess uh, of fire. Why was Grandpa researching Hawaiian myths? I don't know, but I have a page that you were all excited and jazzed about. There we go. Uh, let me An take a open peek. desk drawer. Ah, lovely. I can open drawers. It's locked. It's, it's locked. Okay, are they all locked? locked? They're probably all locked. It's locked. Yeah, they're locked. I really wish I knew if that was in tune or not. Nice. I mean, this is a very inquisitive later. Alright, let's go listen to that voicemail. I feel like that's going to progress the game. And go. A tape recorder. Nice. Let's play it. Hello. This is Howard James Wright with a message for my granddaughter, Sarah Elizabeth Wright. So if anyone else is listening, they can... Start off immediately, please. <laughs> <clears throat> <clears throat> throat> 
Zara, if you are listening to this, then it means, well, it means I'm gone. But I don't want you to be too sad about it. That's just the way life goes sometimes. So, chin up, my little pixie. Remember our grand moments. All the adventures we had when you were a little one and I wasn't such a cranky old man. I, I know you have questions for me. It's true I kept secrets from you and your mother but there were good reasons. There are things in this world greater than ourselves and I needed to protect you from them. I didn't want either of you to face the dangers that I've had to... I never wanted to place such a burden on your shoulders but now it, it's unavoidable. Pixie, I need your help. But I can't just tell you. I have to show you. You will need to see for yourself. This world is full of secrets. From the tallest tree to the deepest river. In every breath of wind and every dancing flame. All you have to do is look. Goodbye, Sarah. I love you very much. This game is kind of legit. Hi, Grandpa. I was not expecting this level of quality out of this game. I thought it'd be kind of short, but it looks like we're might be in for a long haul. Oh man, my old A station. I spent hours playing games on this thing. Damn, the adapter's missing. Probably for the best. I wouldn't get anything done today if I started playing. All right, so he still sounds like Ash Ketchum to me. Nah. The Hero with a Thousand Faces, by Joseph Campbell. I guess we need to, um, do hmm. the diary What's book? This? Yeah, the journal pages. So I don't know how many journal pages there are. An old bicycle. Can I write it? Hiking by train. I'm leaving by train. Fair enough. Alright, so... Hmm, can we open this trunk? Maybe? No, can we reach? Oh, I'm sliding again. Ah. Uh. The old gramophone. Some nice music. Okay, um, in fairness, I am a little lost, which is good. It, it's good that I I'm a little lost. He sure could draw, though. I mean, look at that goddess dragon thing. Oh, Pele. Hold goddess on. Goddess of fire. All right. Why was Grab They say Pele. Should I turn this to be Pele? Right now it's Fu saying. Now it's Pele. Um, I assume I need more pages of the diary? Because I probably can't do anything else with this, the right? It says play me. That's definitely Grandpa's handwriting. Yeah, I played it. This world is full of secrets. Okay, hold on, that's a hint. From the tallest tree to the deepest river, in every breath of wind and every dancing flame, all you have to do is look. Tallest tree Goodbye, to the Sarah. deepest river. I love you very much. Hold on. Okay. Tallest tree to the deepest river. Something about fire? What was that last part? This world is Tall tree, secret. deepest river, wind flame. From the tallest tree to the deepest river. So, tree, river, river, wind, wind fire. Tree, river, wind, fire. You okay. You might be yeah. copyrighted. Enough of I that. just realized that might be copyrighted Bears. music. By Brian F These I books are all so old. Much. Hey, wait. Is that the biography of George Lucas? I don't know, Ash Ketchum. Is that I'm sure some the of these biography? are worth keeping. But I'm not going to sit down and sort through them right now. Well, what are you here for, then? That trunk looks like it's important. And I really can't open any of these drawers. An open desk drawer. Okay, is there a... Is this a closed a desk, desk drawer? drawer? Oh, no, it's open. Cool. There's really nothing inside of it? Um... Hmm. Uh... I can't open any of these things. Not even the magnifying glass. Celtic myths. It's a magnifying glass. Okay, yes, it's a magnifying glass for, for magnifying, magnifying things. Glass. I understand. For magnifying things. Jeez. That is... I can't. 
All right, hold on. I kind of need to uh, stop slip sliding now. Thank you. All right, this has Time to, to do with it, something. I don't even know where he got it from. On one of his travels, I guess. I can't believe Mom wants to sell this. I get that he missed a lot of her childhood, but come on. It looks it like I, I can, I can it zoom I too. It's it needs a key to open. Okay, so we need a key for My it. My grandpa. It weighs like. T there is no way. All right, I'm sorry, I'm like cutting her legends. off a little bit, but there's no one to play. It's a chessboard. Fairies. Also, a typewriter. Her, uh, her quality changes randomly. Like, listen to this one. <sighs> it's going to take forever to sort through all these. Grandpa sure did like his books. And then listen to this one. I wonder who's winning. Yeah, they're like they're different. Um, can I take -uh. that? I, these books. Uh, myths and I don't legends. know what to take. I feel like you're a, you're something. I feel like I've interacted with everything. Hold on, maybe these journal entries are, are actually like the solution. Uh, I finally landed on Hawaii, and I'll soon begin my arduous climb of Mauna Loa. I'm not much of a climber, but I'm filled with determination. I will, however, first take some days to recuperate from the tiresome travel for which my fear of flights did not exactly improve. Not only was the pilot rude and dismissive of safety protocols, he also seemed unsure at times what he was doing. Regardless, I am here and I'll spend the coming days in the village of Pahala. Whatever secrets Pele, goddess of, fighter, goddess of fire, holds is now within my grasp. I have definitely reached the right place, although I am weary from travel. I am too excited to sleep. The villagers are friendly, but warn me of hurting customs, something I have no intent to do. I've also noticed an alchemic symbol of fire etched over people's doorways. It connects to Pele, of course, but it's linked to the crest as well. So that triangle is important for, for stuff. Is Did the controller just connect? Oh, I think I touched the mouse. That's the problem. So I sometimes realize the mouse is just chilling over in the corner of the screen. I'm like, not about that. Hello? Are you gonna... What the heck is happening? Hello? Yes? Well, there's journal page two. Let's figure this out. It seems no coincidence that both the resting place of Pele and Parakaka would happen to be in mountains. The trek has go gone well, although the winds are ominous. My clothing necessarily carried me well so far. Shoot, I closed it out too early. Um, the guide I hired upon arrival has proved invaluable, not only in his knowledge of the thick forest, but also for his rich knowledge in his company. Not unexpectedly, the symbol of water can be found at the peak of the stomach, along with the alchemical symbol of water. Again, these symbols seem interconnected. While well, one set are alchemic symbols known to many people, the other seems strange and no cultural design that I am at least that I at least I'm knowledgeable about. The encounter on Hawaii makes me certain that the other two elements must bear significance as well. What will I find on this mountain? A trapdoor? This is probably where we came in from, right? Probably. Yeah, I can only open and close that door. It's locked. All of these are it's locked. Yep, it's locked. they're all locked. It's, it's I doubt locked. a random one to be open. That's that's openable. Hold on. What was that? Another journal page? Is the there another one in here? Thousand faces. Okay, hold, hold up. Campbell. Hold up, catch him. Oh, that's page five. Elfston. Also sometimes known as troll stones. The subject is Scandinavian folklore. Normal rocks with holes in them the size of an acorn were considered lucky, otherworldly, and useful. Hung from the necks of livestock it would protect them and their farmers alike from malicious predators. Trolls and even incubi. In some tales, the owner of true Elfston is also able to see the otherwise invisible common troll through the hole of the rock. While several of these were on display, only one of them only one of them looked to be the one I was looking for, carved in a way that no average jeweler could and with ore in place where a hole should be. I didn't acquire it though the most through the most honest of means, but no one came to harm, and I'm sure its disappearance won't be noticed. I wonder how it fits with all this though, I must study it thoroughly. Alright, so we're definitely just looking for the remaining notebook pages. That is what's what's up right now so I, I found two over there i found one on that table i haven't found much on this side of the room i don't think well actually one was right there i think so hold on is there a drawer on this no and there's nothing oh <sighs> it's going to take fairies okay by brian Frow. yeah she just and reads the title of the books like over and over again um is that something i want to go down and look at it but like eh all right, I guess I just need to find the other two book pages, but I know this this grandfather clock is going to be for a puzzle. I just wish I found some keys already, you know, like keys would be a great thing to have, especially in a, a game where everything is somehow locked. We'll figure this out. Don't worry. Goodbye, Sarah. What? I love oh, hold on. From the tallest tree. 
to the dancing river, something about the wind, and then the flame. Oh! Oh! I can bend down and, and, and interact with them individually. Okay, hold on. So, tree. Oh, okay. These can be pushed. River. Wind. And then fire. Oh, shoot. I gotta go around the horn. Hold on. One more. Fire. <laughs> I don't oh. think I'm getting any more out of this globe. Okay. Okay, that this was something. Looks like... Is this a second part of my necklace? Okay. And I bet that's what we read about in Journal Whoa. Entry 5. Okay. There we go. I got a necklace part. Nice. Okay. Uh, to look through my necklace, press the triangle? Whoa. Serious whoa. Oh, yeah. This was something about the trolls, right? We could, like, it's look locked. through. Okay, but take notice how it's weird. And none of them are moving. That okay. old man never could fix anything properly. Just take note that there is a weird event going on. What is this? That is a key. A small key. Is it for this? Mm. No. The key I have doesn't fit here. Okay, hold on. Let me take this off. There we go. Now we're getting interesting. Does it open these drawers? It's locked. Yep. It's locked. Okay. So let's just look through every single drawer. Nothing. Nothing. Something. Okay, that was a journal page. Pens, so that's basically nothing. So this side is nothing except for whatever's in the top drawer. Okay, this side has basically nothing. I'm slip sliding around like I'm on ice. Picture, give me that picture. Oh, it's an old photograph. Take that. Uh, empty and empty. Okay, hold on. Let me stop sliding now. <laughs> Let me stop sliding. There we go. Uh, let's read this journal entry. It's entry three, and then we can look at the photograph. The alchemical symbol of Earth combined with the Chinese one for tree. While on a trip, while a trip has yet again gone well, and my research has once again led me to these symbols, I can draw no conclusion. I have spent most of my life researching these mythological connections, yet again I reach my destination and nothing, almost as if this is an extremely elaborate prank. I often wonder if my daughter is right. Months, nay years of planning only to eventually find a temple or shrine with another symbol, another riddle, and another clue. However, at the same time, it feels like I'm so close to finding something. We read Journal Entry 5. And this is a picture from Egypt. Uh, it says, Sultan Hassan's Mosque Madraza, Egypt, 1996. I bet that's the code for this number puzzle. Huh. It's locked. Okay, hold on. Well, I have a combination for it. It's locked. Do I not have a combination for it? Oh. What could the combination be? Uh, okay. It's not 1996, it's but it's, you know, whatever this... Oh, it's Pixie. It's Pixie. It's That's what locked. he calls me. There you go. Pixie. Open. And we get a key. Ornamental key. Probably for the grandfather clock. Put it in. Equip the necklace again. Okay. Um. I probably need to select the clock hand somehow. Yeah, that seems about right. It uh, weighs like there. Come to think of it, can you it weighs work like with anything pounds. down here? It won't budge. Weren't these triangles in the journal pages? Yeah, this they clock were. This clock hand is a triangle facing inwards. Okay. Oh, okay. So I need to match up the alchemical symbols with what they actually are. All right. So that means we need to conduct. All right. Hold on. So fire is upward triangle with fire in it and a picture of fire, right? Yes, okay. So then that leaves uh, upwards facing triangle with a picture of fire on it. That's none of these. Well, I know water is the downward facing one, so that means... Oh, can we only click over one at a time? Oh, I gotcha. Okay. Paul, well, let's do water first. Okay, boom. This is the water one, and it needs to go to the water. Okay, and then I can select this one. Okay, the upward one is for fire. Let me move that over there very slowly because I'm on a, com a controller. It won't and budge. precise movements isn't what we are known for in controller land. Okay, and then... Looks like we need to consult the journal again. Okay, I can rotate this, right? Can I rotate this? 
very slowly. Okay, hold on. Got it. Okay, so Earth. I have the Earth one mixed up. Regular downward pointing. That one is it's stuck in place. Where is the regular downward it's stuck pointing? In, it won't budge. Oh. Okay, whatever. I'll just move this one. Regular downward pointing. Okay. That one is water. Okay. So I need to set yes, these yes, correctly. Yes, yes, yes. I know what I must do. Maybe the answer Wait. is in Grandpa's journal pages. This one is water. It won't budge. Hold on. I, I want to keep calling her Edith Finch. She's not. She's Sarah. Somehow. Okay, there we go. Okay, then which one was fire? Just It's the triangle facing upwards with the fire picture in it. Okay. So, the closest thing to a triangle facing upwards with a picture of fire in it. Sorry, I keep pressing the wrong button. Um, okay, so tree is downward with line. So tree is correct already, which means that this one. It won't, it won't buy. I probably that, need oh, hold to on. select the clock hand somehow. You know what? It's downward fire. So this is the one. A downward triangle. That's what I mean to say. Okay. There we go. Nice. Which leaves this one to be fire. I'm getting this. It's just taking me ages to figure this out. It won't budge. How to work mechanically. And that's on me for playing with a controller. Awesome that the game allows that though right off the bat. That's pretty cool. And that means that this one is... Dang it. There. Wait. Right. Was that Perfect. it? Perfect. Did okay. I do it? Yes, we did it. Oh. I didn't even need the fourth journal whoa, entry. Whoa, whoa. What's happening? No. No, no, no. Oh, we got sucked into the computer world. <laughs> Wait. That was the first time I traveled by magic. Pulling at the thread that would unravel my grandfather's mysteries. I so wish he told me sooner. So we could have gone on at least one adventure together. Instead, I went on his adventure. The one that never was. That's the name of the game. But that is a longer story. For another time. Oh, so this was like a demo. Or like a like a trailer? Because they're definitely advancing more on this. This is really, really inventive gameplay, to be honest with you. It's... Sorry, hold on. Do you probably want to say something? Or is this just the main menu again? Okay. Um, wow. Hold on. I like to let the credits roll while I talk about people's games. So, I'm going to let that happen. Uh, that was really great. Had a lot of fun playing through it. There was some mechanical issues, just with, like the controller slip, slip sliding around and stuff. But that could, you know, very well be my controller. Super fun, and uh, I'm excited to see what more comes out of this. This is a free game on Steam, so I figured it, it has to be, you know... When I saw how high quality it was, and like there's voice acting, and there's decent models, and her hands, I mean, they look realistic enough. It looks AAA. I think it could be something cool. Uh, yeah, so... This is awesome. I'm happy with this game. And I want to let the rest of the credits roll before I, I start to close the video. I think... Well, obviously, I skipped over the th fourth notebook page. That's kind of my mistake. And it took me a while just to get the feel of what I needed to do. But, you know. This is good. I'm I'm excited to uh, to see what's going on. If you guys want to play the game yourself, I'll have a, a link to either the game's website or the game's Steam page. Whichever one makes more sense, depending on, on what I see there at the... Uh, you know, in the editing stage. So I guess it's going to be all for me. Uh, I want to thank you all so, so much for watching. If you have enjoyed, please like, subscribe, tell your friend about the video if you think they would enjoy it. It means a lot to me and you guys spread my videos around. I'll catch you all back here next time in my next video. Until then, as always, take care.